Today we will be making a wet felted bowl or creature. You will need some wool roving, a bamboo mat, two rubber bands, some warm soapy water in a spray bottle, a piece of bubble wrap twice the size of the bamboo mat, a piece of mesh, and a foam circle resist. Start by breaking your wool into eight even pieces. They should be slightly larger than the width of your resist. Wool roving is made out of long wool fibers. If you hold your hands too close together, you won't be able to pull them apart. Instead, try holding your hands a few inches apart and then give a good tug. Let's see if we can speed this up a bit. There's eight pieces plus a little extra for details. Lay your resist on top of the bubble wrap with the bubbles pointing up. Lay two layers of wool over your resist, one layer horizontal and one layer vertical. Cover with mesh and spray with soapy water. Use your hands to smooth out your layers of wool. Peel back the mesh then make a bubble wrap sandwich and flip. Wrap the ends of the wool around the resist. It helps to get it wet first. Make it as tight as you can. Now add two more layers of wool one horizontal, one vertical. Cover with mesh, spray soapy water, and flatten. Remove the mesh, make a bubble wrap sandwich, flip, and fold the ends of the wool back over. Add two more layers. Cover, spray, flatten, flip, Repeat the process until you've added eight layers of wool, four on each side. Give your final layers a good rub with soapy water. You'll start to notice that the wool is already starting to hold together. Now it's time to use friction to speed up the felting process. So make a bubble wrap sandwich, roll it around the rolled up bamboo mat, and fasten with rubber bands. Roll your wool burrito back and forth, back and forth, 20 to 30 times on the table, or you can pick it up and roll it between your hands. Unwrap your burrito, flip, rotate, wrap, and roll again. Repeat this process four times total. Open, flip, rotate, wrap, roll. Open, flip, rotate, wrap, roll. Rub the edges with your fingers to make sure they're felting too. The bubble wrap is gentle and gets the felting process to start slowly, but now it's time to speed things up by using the bamboo mat alone. So no more bubble wrap, you can put that aside. Roll it back and forth 20 to 30 times, open it up, flip, rotate, wrap, roll. Repeat this process four times. 
open, flip, rotate, wrap, roll. Now you need to cut a hole that will become the mouth of your creature. Pinch the wool and keep cutting until you reach the resist, but try not to cut through the foam circle. The next step is mending your edges. Spray the hole with a little soapy water and rub your fingers back and forth. This might take a few minutes to do a good job. Now you can remove your resist and we're going to roll it in the bamboo two more times. Congratulations! It's time to wash out the soap. Take your creature over to the sink and run it under hot water, then cold water, then hot water, then cold water. Squeeze out any excess water, then stuff with grocery bags. Your bowl will keep this shape when it dries. Whew! That's all there is to it. Now go get started, and good luck!